Colossians chapter 1 verses 13. Who had delivered from the power of darkness and had translated us into the kingdom of his dear son? Well, one, who had? That's Jesus. He delivered us from the power of darkness when he filled us with the Holy Ghost. He, had, he translated us. He transformed us into the kingdom of his dear son. He transformed us just like Jesus. John chapter 8 verses 12. Again, Jesus spoke to them saying, I am the light of the world. He is the light of this world. You know, and whosoever follows me shall not walk in darkness. You are a follower of Christ. You're a Christian. You got the Holy Ghost. You will not walk in darkness, but you will have the light of light. See, once you got the Holy Ghost, you got the light. You are that light. Just like Jesus is that light. 2 Peter chapter 2, verses 9. See, you are a chosen race. You are chosen by God. A royal priesthood, a holy nation, a people for his own possession. You are his own possession. He claimed you. That you may proclaim the excellences of him who called you out of darkness. He called you out of darkness. He chose in you into his marvelous light. See, he not just only delivered us out of the power of darkness, but he transformed us into his image to be like him. 2 Corinthians chapter 3, verses 18. And we who are with unveiling faces, that's the Holy Spirit, contemplate, I can't pronounce it, contemplate the Lord's glory and being transformed into the image with his increasing glory which comes from the Lord who is the Spirit. When you get the Holy Ghost, you're transformed into His image. You become more like Jesus. Romans chapter 2 verses, I mean 12 verses 2. Do not conform to the pattern of this world. Don't be like this world. You know, do not even conform to anything of this world, but be transformed by the renewing of your mind. And then you'll be able to test and approve what is God's will? What God will is, and good pleasure and perfect will. He said, "You know, you got to be renewed in the transforming of your mind." He said, "Don't be like the world. Don't think like the world. You once was like that. You once was in the world, but you got to be transformed. You got to become more like Jesus." Galatians chapter two, verses twenty: "I have been crucified with Christ. It's no longer I who live, but Christ who lives in me. And the life I now live in the flesh." I live by faith in the Son of God who loved me and gave himself for me. See, we got to crucify ourselves just like Jesus crucified him.